tasks in QGIS. Reprojecting layers. Did you know that with every tool in QGIS, you can choose between running a single process or a batch process? Let's go through each process and explain why you might choose one over the other. We will start with the single process. Let's say you want to permanently alter the projection of only one of your layers. Using the Reproject Layer tool, QGIS outputs the layer in your desired coordinate reference system. This may help if you wish to implement other geoprocessing analyses on your geospatial data. In the top menu bar, select the Processing tab and click on Toolbox. In the search bar, type Reproject Layer and double-click on the tool when it pops up. Under Target CRS, use the drop-down arrow to select from your recently used coordinate reference systems. If the CRS you want to reproject to is not there, click the Select CRS icon to search for your desired coordinate reference system in the search bar. Click on your target CRS and select the back arrow to return to the tool. Under Reprojected, save the layer that will be outputted to a desired location by selecting the Browse icon. If you would like to create a temporary layer instead, skip this step. Click on Run. The reprojected layer has now been added to your Layers pane. Click on Close. If you outputted a temporary layer and would like to save it, you can do so by clicking on the temporary scratch layer icon in the Layer pane. The Save Scratch Layer window will open. Change the format to Esri Shapefile, and you can select the Browse icon next to File Name to save it. Give your new layer a file name and select Save. Select OK when done. For more information on QGIS, visit the UTM Library QGIS playlist.